Hello Vinyl community, it's Mikko back again in the Vinyl Corner. It's time for another recent Vinyl Finds video. This time I will show you Vinyl records I bought in January 2013. But first, we see cheer. What's playing on background is Hell Songs and their brand new Wine record. This has their first two EPs on on a one one vinyl lounge and pieces of heaven, a glimpse of hell. I ordered this directly from from band and I asked if they could sign it for me. Here's signatures by two of the band members. Funny thing is that this signature here is their new vocalist and if I remember correctly she doesn't sing on these EPs. If you don't know the band it's it's very, very cool cover band from Sweden. They make lounge covers from metal songs. Uh, on this EP they have covered Metallica, Seek and Destroy, Black Sabbath, Paranoid, Judas Priest, Break into Law, Iron Maiden, Run to the Hills, One Hail and Jump, and Murderhead, August Matter. This EP here's War Peaks by Black Sabbath, The Evil That Men Do by Iron Maiden, Losers and Winners by Accept, Eagle Fly Free by Halloween and I just want you by Ozzy Osbourne. Very very good stuff. Then I bought one final box set. This is Finnish very popular Finnish pop duo PMMP and this is box set is called Kaksitoutta Luku. This has their first five LPs and also one bonus LP with some covers and other rarities. The bonus vinyl doesn't have any kind of cover art. It comes with very nice booklet with all the lyrics and nice pictures. Here's their debut album. Unfortunately, they have changed the cover art for this this vinyl release. Here's their second album. The third one. This one is very interesting stuff. Here's traditional Finnish children's songs, which they have covered. Very nice versions. This one I've shown before, but I can't show this enough. My number one holy grail, Amok by Sentenced Picture Disc with all the four band members' signatures. I'm so happy to have this. 
Here's some tango on Slager, Topi Sorsakoski and his first solo album Hurmio from 1985. After this solo album he joined the very famous Finnish band Agents and they may made four popular studio albums which sold platinum and gold here in Finland. In the early 1990s he left the band but in 2007 he came back to the band for this, this record called Renegades. Renegades used to be a band from Birmingham, England. They were very popular here in Finland in the 60s and this album includes Renegades covers by Topi Sonsakoski ja Agents. Funny thing about this record is here and I'm not sure if you can see the logo but it says no computers no computers were used producing or recording this this record so this this is all analog then some recommendation by Jonas from Sweden this is Harry Nilsson Nilsson Smilsson this is early US pressing the cover is pretty beat up but somehow I like the ring wear here somehow it, it looks looks cool and Jonas you were absolutely right this is very good stuff and this sounds fantastic uh, if you have the musical vinyl repress from this let me know how how that sounds because this this early US press sounds fantastic. Then some Judas Priest. Here's Sin After Sin. This is UK pressing from 1977. I'm not sure if this is original one because here's this kind of hype sticker. If you have the original, please let me know. It, it come, came with only this black white inner sleeve which I have replaced with this polylined after washing this. Here's the label. It's CBS32005. Please leave a comment if you if you know something about about the original pressing. Here's another Church Priest album, Point of Entry, Entry. Not my favorite Church Priest album, but I, I like the cover, cover art very much. Here's some Finnish pop rock with lots of progressive elements. This is One Hertz and Brothers Experience. This is their debut album from 2001. It was issued on vinyl in 2011. Nice Gatefold double LP. Brothers album. This is Love Remains the Same from 2008. This was also released on vinyl in 2011. This is their third studio album. Very nice 
inner sleeves and custom labels. They have released four studio albums now and they are releasing their fifth one on this, this spring. So if you like progressive rock, check out this, this band. Here's Phil Collins, Serious Hits Live. Kate Bush, Hounds of Love. Very good, very good album. I just love Kate Bush. Here's Marillion. Real to real live album. <coughs> Excuse me. Let's take some coffee. Cheers. And then some Iron Maiden, of course. Here's some Mother of Life and Death. like all of their latest albums this is picture disc look this look very nice but it sound like shit I wish they would respect their fans and release also their music on high quality black vinyl pressings. Anyway, those are better than nothing. So here's their latest album, Final Frontier. I heard from my local record shop that this is already out of print so I had to pick up this fast before the prices go sky high. Very, very beautiful, almost like Predator kind of Eddie. I have now all of the, their studio albums on vinyl except Virtual 11 and the X Factor and what I'm looking for most is Brave New World. If you find it for reasonable price please let me know, I would really love to have it on vinyl. And of course, if you find Rock in Rio Triple LP for a reasonable price, send me a message. That would be awesome to have, have on final. Then some more Iron Maiden Power Slave. This is brand new picture disc series. And Live After Death also from the same picture disc series. I will show you more more these two when I have the rest rest two of the box set somewhere in time and seventh son of seventh son. I'm very looking forward to have those on gatefold because I've never seen those excellent cover art on gatefold before. So I think I will shoot separate video about the limited edition picture disc box set when, when I have all the eight records. So those were the 
vinyl records I bought in January 2013. Until next time, keep peace.